have 103 different aircraft types here at the Fleet Air Arm Museum, many of which we consider could be called national treasures in the world of aviation. We've got the short 184, the remains of the only aircraft to take part in the Battle of Jutland. We've got Concorde 002, the first British Concorde to fly. And we've got more recent aircraft into the collection, such as the Sea King Mark IV, a commando helicopter used in many parts of the world by the Royal Navy and Fleet Air Arms supporting the commando forces. Westland Sea King ZA-298 has been involved with most of the battle zones and conflict areas around the world on the front line since 1980. It was in the Falklands, it got shot at in flight in the Falklands and survived that. It was shot at in Bosnia and survived that. And towards the end of its flying career, it was actually brought down with a rocket launched grenade in Afghanistan, causing significant damage to the aircraft and the crew were very lucky to survive that attack as well. Put back into service, the aircraft was actually recovered from the desert in Afghanistan, rebuilt and put back into service. And it was the aircraft that was chosen to fly the Olympic flame up the River Thames to start the launch of the Olympic Games in London in 2012. So we think that seeking ZA-298 could definitely be called a national treasure and it's undoubtedly one of the most historically significant aircraft in a collection anywhere in the world today.